Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, I'm Jennifer, and today we're talking about the pinwheel breath and how the pinwheel breath helps to support us going down and coming up out of our squat. And then inside the squat on shifting the weight. So when we're in something like a squat, it's really easy to sink and buckle and hang. And that's not what we're looking for in the squat, right? We want this full communication through the leg, the pelvis, the glutes, up into the spine. And so to have that deep reflexive involuntary support of our core muscles while relaxing our diaphragm um, can be really, really important to finding ease in a position like the squat. So today we're gonna be using the arc barrel. And this is one of my favorite places to squat because the soles of the feet can really contour around the barrel. And I find that I have more heel, ball of the foot contact, and that my femurs can draw deeper into my hip socket. So one of my favorite places to squat. So I'm gonna come up onto the apex of the barrel. Remember our pinwheel breath is I'm thinking of a big pinwheel in front of my face. And I take a deep inhale and then slow, steady exhale. Good, so when I found my reflexive core was when I allowed myself to come down into the squat. Let's look at that again. So I take a deep inhale and slow, steady exhale. And there at the bottom, I did another inhale, another exhale. I waited for that shrink wrapping around my lower belly and around my lower spine before I lifted myself up. So I'm really giving my spine support and I'm giving my legs a good place to work from with this deep core support. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.